Hey folks, welcome back to Let's Play Samurai Warriors on the series GG. I accidentally clicked the um, stop recording button a little early last time, so it's kind of been mid-word, but um, we're back, and we're ready to talk to Lady Kai and figure out what's next in the story. Oh, Juki Bora, but why? What is Lady Cha-Cha doing? Wow, she looks shocked. I wish to report to Lady Cha-Cha that I have returned. Can you organize a meeting, Lady Kai? She doesn't seem to be on the map. Da -da -da. Yes, yes, I'm sure she's waiting. Yeah, I'm just like her personal secretary now. Lady Chacha, I've returned. Da, 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 da. I was really kind of hoping you guys would, you know, reconcile and join the other side. I wish to thank you for allowing me to meet with my brother. It was a joy beyond what I could have hoped for. You know, I mean, there's other types of joy, like the joy I might find by expressing my love for you, but apparently that's not going to be a thing, so... Yeah, now you're ready to fight with no reservations. That's what you're saying, isn't it? No, he was trying to say thank you. Lady Chacha? That is not why I sent you. You were supposed to negotiate peace! I thought I made that clear! I'm aware of that. I believe you wanted me to escape with my brother. We could go to America and Hollywood. If you knew that I wanted, then why did you return? I... I... What the fuck, man? I was trying to give you an out. <laughs> I have returned to protect you, my lady, and to fight. What nonsense. I mean, what nonsense? Are you really that much of a fool? Kind of, yeah. Yes, my lady, I'm afraid I am. Da, da, da. Well, I guess I shouldn't be surprised by that. But I will fight for victory. I will make sure that you do not lose hope, Lady Chacha. You will lose your life, of course. Do you believe I still have hope? I mean, how clearly do I have to express that I have no emotions of any kind? I do. If you had really abandoned all hope, you could have escaped or surrendered to Master Ieyasu. Actually, I think hope in this case... Those things might express a hope that she will be allowed to live. She probably understands that she's going to be killed regardless. Da -da -da. But you did not. I believe you have the conviction to fight until the very last, to cling steadfastly to hope. That's right, I personally, with my rainbow pixie magic attacks, will defeat the enemy. Just as Magger Master Nagamasa and Lady Uichi did. They really... I don't know that Lady Oichi did. Um, Lady Oichi didn't die at the same time Nagamasa did. The game kind of cheats a bit there. I mean, cha the, the story they're trying to tell for Cha-Cha about her being willing to stand up against the superior force and throw away her life to protect her ideals or whatever, I mean, that works together. That works if her parents, like, both died together staring down the, you know, superior, victorious armies of the Oda. But that's not what happened. Lady Oichi, if, if that had happened, that had been what happened, Cha-Cha wouldn't be here. Lady Oichi took their children away from the castle. Nagamasa had a heroic last stand and died. Lady Oichi married another lord and then decided at that point with her daughters a little bit more grown that she was kind of sick of it all and decided not to escape. Um, but that was that was Katsuie's death, which like, Oichi and Katsuie's relationship isn't really touched upon at all in this game. Uh, it doesn't fit well into the narrative. Nagamasa and Oichi were introduced in this series. Nagamasa was introduced, I think, for SW2 where they made Oichi a little bit older than she was in SW1, where she was like a little child, basically. And the whole the whole story of Nagamasa and Oichi in those games was just how deeply they were in love with each other, which doesn't, doesn't work that great, because at the end, Oichi remarried. I don't know why I'm going off on a tangent about this, except that, yeah, like, they keep alternating between explaining bits of history that are different and then just pretending history was what this story would want it to be. Dot, dot, dot. Anyway, thanks, JG, for lecturing everyone about my parents. The strength to never give up on life. That is what you desired, wasn't it, my lady? What do you desire, Grizzly Water? Dot, dot, dot. Dot, dot, dot. Of course. I can, I can avoid talking just as long as you can. No matter what grand justification Master Yes you may have, I will resist in order to protect those I love. Indeed. I mean, I... 
To do that, I will need your help, Yukimura. I will give it gladly. He just said hi, but whatever. Thank you, Yukimura. Oh. Her character model looks weird when it smiles now. They've, they've had her be like the icy face for so long. Now it just looks weird. But I think it was supposed to be a big deal that she smiled there. Probably if you read her character wiki, somebody spent like four sentences talking about that. I was unable to convince my brother to change his mind. I didn't actually try, mind you. I apologize for my failure. Is that so? Come on, tell the truth. You had no intentions of turning him to our side. Hidetada. I thought you guys were friends. I thought that's the only reason he's still alive. Ah. Oh. Is Yukimura looking for a place to die? Because I'll gladly give him one. Yeah, that's that's real uh, tactful thing to say to his brother. No, I do not believe so. He simply has something that he cannot give up on. He cannot give up on his friendship with Quigley. He understands your desire to bring peace to the land, but he cannot abandon his principles. Yukimura will fight. Did he just... Then I must bear the pain of crushing that noble spirit. He did not. He did not. You suck far too much to do that. Bop, bop, bop. Yes, you must carry out the task of protecting the peace, which is to come. Of course. Of course. Oh, well, we're done with the, the chatty chapter and back to the fighting, I think. Summer 1615. Ieyasu lay siege to Osaka Castle with a force of 150,000 men. The men of the Toyotomi army numbered barely 50,000. They knew the fate that awaited them. It does take longer to say things in Japanese. This is, like, actually established fact. Even then, one man would not resign himself to his destiny. That burning intensity in his eyes betrayed not an ounce of fear or sorrow. His only target, the head of Ieyasu Tokugawa, the final battle of the age was about to begin. Oh, I guess he probably wants to kill Hidetada too. Hidetada too. Electric boot. But that's actually established uh, fact. Like, it, it, apparently I was reading about it, um, in a, um, uh, sort of piece about, um, the air war over the Pacific in World War II. Um, one of the one of the little edges that the Americans had over the Japanese is that uh, verbal instructions in English, American English specifically, are just sim are just they're shorter sentences with simpler structure, uh, and like radios cutting in and out and losing individual words and stuff. Like it was just easier to clearly communicate direction quickly in English before the comms would start going offline and coming back than it does in Japanese. Like it just literally takes more a little bit more time not like double the time but more time to deliver the same idea verbally in japanese than it would in english and that was actually relevant in the pacific uh, air war because of these unreliable comms so it's but you you do it's a silly thing but you pick it up or you're reading along with text as a japanese narrator is you're like oh okay now i gotta wait for the japanese narrator to catch up the time is finally here the game is almost over <laughs> osaka castle this is the story, uh, they spent a lot of time on Mazuyuki, more time on Mazuyuki than I was, ex I was actually surprised at how little story was left after the game had fully embraced Yukimura as the hero, uh, and how much of it was about Mazuyuki, but yeah, I mean, this, this is what the game is about, and, um, unless this is your first Samurai Warrior game, you kind of know how Yukimura's story resolves, so we're closing in on the big, uh, climax here, leave it to me! I will keep Lady Cha-Cha safe. Don't worry about us, Lord Yukimura, and just keep moving forward. Thank you, Lady Kai. I will give my heart and soul to this course. Doesn't seem to be anybody in this little, like, rock garden that uh, Kunoichi occasionally chose to hang out in. These two guys are still over here, as they apparently will be for the rest of the game until they die. I have no regrets. You have always been there to support me. 
Shiguchi, from the time I was a child, I owe you a debt of gratitude. I am not worthy of your thanks. It will be the greatest honor. I can know how to fight for you. Sakabe, if you want to go back to Ueda, now's your last chance. You coward. Don't say that, Lord Yukimura. I have decided that I'm never running away again. Sakabe, I'm sorry. I will be relying on you. When did he run away before? Like, they keep talking about how he's not a alpha male braille, brave warrior dude, but... I love everyone, if you want to be honest. I always think something good will happen, but it never does. Sorry. Okay, never mind. We, I thought that was like new dialogue from the guy who normally says he wants to fight you. Maybe it is, but I'm thinking I'm mixing up two townspeople. I wonder if one I recruited. That just makes me want to jump in even more. Okay, I don't think I recruited you. If I did, I kind of regret it. Let's take a try to hang out. Mm. Master Matabe seems a little too keen. I just hope he doesn't jeopardize our chances by charging out alone. Yes, but it's also a fact that his dauntless courage inspiring the troops. That is true, but there are two sides to that coin, young Jedi. That's right, he said young Jedi. Didn't you see that there in the text box? Oh, Sokka's really the best. It's a shame it's about to get sacked by its enemies. Master Mother, you... My lord, please watch over Lord Yukimura. Please watch over all of us as we show the land the way the Senate fight. Nike, I interrupted your prayers to my father, whom we've apparently deified. I apologize, and I'm not moving away from you swiftly, because you're creeping me out. I don't think ancestor prayer was a, was a big thing in China for a lot of Chinese history. It, Chinese folk religions. It's not, not as much in Japan, but I don't think you're supposed to pray to somebody else's dead parents, are you? It's time. That's out of character. I'm calling it. This game's broken character. I'm ready when you are to say the word. I know I can always rely on you, so I was okay. Hey, well, I am your number two ninja. You're number two already. I think I'm actually a little nervous. I hope not. Your bold confidence inspires the troops and raises morale. All right. In that case, let's go out there and finish it off before dinner. That's the spirit. Finish me off, Kanuichi. <clears throat> So disappointing. If only I had the courage and skill that you have, Master Yukimura. What are you saying? I believe that you are the one I can count on the most to take control of things should things not go to plan, Master Katsunaga. You honor me, Lord Ma Master Yukimura. I will drum up all the courage I have and fight and protect the Toyotomi and all that good shit. We don't have to wait for the enemy to come at us. Why don't we just go out there and show them what we can do? I admire your spirit, but we are far fewer in number. We must prioritize the coordination of our movements above all else. You're such a warrior, Yuki Mora. This is my chance to shine. Leave it to me. I should write something about the Chronicles about the state of the land before the summer campaign. The state of the land before the summer campaign. You know what? I'm going to get up and switch controllers while I'm reading this because I know it's going to give out during this video. Um, in January 1615, the Tokugawa withdrew its army as part of the peace negotiations, but at the same time, continued its preparations for the next battle. In March of the same year, Ieyasu used the misconduct of the Osaka Ronin as a justification to dismiss the Ronin and demand that the Toyotomi relocate. The Toyotomi refused the demand, which caused Ieyasu to once again prepare for war and issue a proclamation to his daimyo. As evidenced by me interrupting to switch controllers. Sorry. Uh, knowing that a showdown was inevitable, the Toyotomi distributed gold and silver to the Ronin and began preparing arms to ready itself for war. And now this long journey back to my love seat. <clears throat> okay, so I guess we would have gotten some Santa coins there if we needed them. We didn't, but it's not hurting anything. And now we're actually going to get back to uh, real combat. Our real monsters. The night before. The son of the mother. I don't even remember what gifts she likes. Probably flowers or something. Give her something nice. Uh, we've got shit tons of wisteria. I'll give her one of those. Please don't consider how unvaluable this is to me as I give it to you as a gift. You shouldn't have, but I am grateful. Here, I thank you, gift. No need to be shy. Oh, it's not the actual... Oh, maybe we can just find out what her favorite flower is before we wrap up this whole series. A peony. 
Happy Cha Cha is fortunate to acquire this. I thought you might like it. This is A P and E. I am familiar with them. Da, 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 da. Wow, she really is into it, Lady Cha Cha. Have I offended you in some way? Yeah, you have offended me by just making me totally want you. No, I was just a little surprised that you would go around giving women flowers like this. Well, I mean, not all women. My lady, I assure you. I am joking, Yukimura. It is very pretty. I will put it in a vase on my bedchamber. Thank you. So we found out her favorite, and it just gives us more black mic, I'm thinking. Yep. Alright. Yukimura, it is time for you to stop giving me peonies and go out and kill my enemies. Yes, Lady Cha Cha. It is time for our final war council. Let us go. My lady. The Tokugawa forces are approaching. They number roughly 150,000. I was wondering if, like, asshole from before, who just had one scene where he was just acting like a jerk, would still be around. 150,000 men. Woohoo! Considering the state of the castle, holding up here is no longer a viable option. We must make this into a field battle and claim the head of Lord Iyasu himself as our only chance. Very well. D do you really think we can win this? No, but, you know, you probably shouldn't ask me that in front of one of my generals. We will win this, isn't that right, Yukimura? I will give it gladly. Well, I think he just said hi, and then, like, her title or something. So I don't really know how the end game is going to be handled. We're going to have missions that we need to... It'll be one of those things where you have to... You can't die during the last mission. You have to fight the last mission successfully and then get to the end. And then some cinematic will likely play where we fail. It's been a tough year for the uh, Toyotomi. Castle battered by cannons. EA? You're supposed to go high, you asshole. Well, the idea is you're supposed to take him out. They're playing this up like the final battle, but I think we've got like three or f you know two or three at least in this um, multi-stage battle. Oh, light of the moon, babe. I mean, Suma. Yoshimasa Kiso. Some guy. If I try to start reading about him now, it'll time out before I can finish. Oh, so we're still not fighting. The Sananamaru. Thank you, Yukimura. I'm sorry, did you say something later, Cha Cha? There was nothing important. Just me expressing thanks to you for the first time ever. Oh, well, it's not literally true, but. So disappointing. That's hard to occur. Nobody else seems to have anything new to say. Just make sure we still have the chance to leave the map, which means we can go out all day long doing silly side missions if we had any left. The only one I... We, we never quite managed to get a bear that you could ride. And I don't know if there's anything you do other than just keep... Wow, what a town. It's too bad it's about to be destroyed. Um, yeah, we never never did the thing where you get a bear, other than the panda. I think I'm actually a little nervous. That's I meant to talk to him. Lord Yukimura, how did the War Council go? Even the mighty Osaka Castle will not be able to withstand against the coming onslaught. We will turn this into a field battle and gamble everything on claiming Master Iyazu's head. It's the only way. Understood. I will accompany you now, wherever you go, my lord. Yep. Even the men's room. That fat tanuki won't get away this time. So called. Thank you both for murdering fat raccoons. Come, we must begin. Multi-stage battle, the Osaka summer campaign. Let's go to battle. You keep what a sound is ready for battle. Ready to end this LP. Actually, if I don't record anything but this game today, I probably will finish the series. In order to ensure that the peace brought by the land... Oh, never mind, the Uesugi are back. I named a previous title, Last Failure of the Uesugi, but I guess they're going to screw up here, too. In order to ensure that the peace brought by a land under the control of Tokugawa would be secure and lasting, Yasu Tokugawa surrounded Osaka Castle once more. The Osaka cam Summer Campaign had begun. So as you see, he's got Munishige Takibana, Takatora Toto, 
Uh, Hidetada Tokugawa. Uh, I can never remember the Uesugi Kenshin's son's name. And um, good old Masamune Date are here to try to kill us. The situation was desperate. Like, yet Yuki Mura still refused to abandon hope. He would fight for victory until the end. A field battle will decide this. I will claim Master Yayasu's head. We mustn't let Yukimura claim all the glory. Let us strike first, you crush Tokugawa. I talk to Tortudo. Following the advice of Mata Matabe Goto, the Toyotomi army put an ambush in place to attack the Tokugawa army as it approached from Yagatu Yamatoguchi. As luck would have it, however, the area around... Domyoji, where the battle would be waged, was enshrouded in a dense fog, compromising the coordination of their movements. Unable to move as one, the Toyotomi army began to be picked off one man at a time. At this time of crisis, Yukimura left Osaka Castle under the stewardship of Shigenara Kimura and hurried with Sazuke to Domoyiji in order to rescue his friends. Battle of Domoyiji. Having lost the Sanada Maru, the Osaka Castle stands exposed before the mighty armies of the Shogunate. Mr. Chaos, Sazuke knows it's time to settle matters with his former master. We can cause friendly fire. We can increase the movement speed of the Allied forces. We definitely want to defeat Masamune, which apparently is not automatic to win the battle, because it's a stratagem thing. We want to claim victory while the health of some guys is above half full. It's one of those fights, huh? And we have to play as Sazuke. And our secondary is apparently always going to be Yukimura, okay. I, I, I don't think I hit the button twice. I think you can... I don't think I was really given the option to use Kunoichi, but... Okay, then, time to get going. Oh, Yukimura. Why do I punching my own head? I want to thank you both. It has not been easy for you, but you have been with me every step of the way. Since I was a small boy, and neither of you have aged since those times. Lord Yukimura. Don't get all formal on us. I don't want to hear any last words. Come to think of it, I have known you for a long time now. And you're really cute. That's true, you always were reckless, even as a child. Well, I was talking about Sazuke, but... Don't say that. I'll kill you for that. And once you and I even fought for reals, he's. You really bring that up? You'd really bring that up yourself? <laughs> it was hilarious the time you tried to murder me. You must let me finish. Oh, I'll take care of that, Yukimura. We have been through a lot, but I'm truly grateful to you both for staying by my side. Lord Yukimura, he just told you no final words. Like I said, we don't need any thanks. We're family, right? Oh. This is cute. Yes. Yes, you are. Come on, let's get started. He's the happiest little boy robot ever. Okay, so we gotta try to defeat Masamune and keep... Uh, this is one of those battles where our allies are gonna be constantly dying, so we just need to keep them going. Alright, probably don't have time to finish this thing in one video. Could be. It's it's hard to say. It's one of those battles that sound, the conditions make it sound like it's quite losable. But generally, when you're playing as like the best characters, it's usually pretty easy. No idea things are this bad. This this sucks. We're gonna get our butts kicked, guys. Okay. So I want to defeat... Well, I want to defeat the standard bears first, no matter what they say. Why don't you go start in on him? Oh, you're not the right guy. Never mind. Crap. When I think of, hold on a second, oh, they're having all sorts of like really charming dialogue. That's why I hate that these games are all subtitled now. Give me a freaking dub. 
If we weren't family, I guess that makes you my little brother. Or if we're family, hmm, that's kind of weird. Uh, it's even weirder for me when I think of a big sister. I think of someone like Lord Yukimura's sister, not you. Well, don't think about that. You never, never, you have no personal relationship with her that we've seen. I left behind something that I really shouldn't have bothered to go back for. He's almost as vital as you can. No, he isn't. Oh, I think I might have just killed like Enid's brother or something. And the different Honda. So where is uh, Masamune? Because if he's advancing, I might be able to get at him. Eh, maybe not. We can't quite get to where he's at, unfortunately. I've got to advance some plot or something to get to where I need to go now, but... Leave this to me, hurry to safety. Oh, why is he embarrassed? I'm sure he's doing good. Okay, I'm still locked out of actually being able to help in these fights. Doesn't look like I was allowed to help him. I'm waiting for this door to open so I can go stop Masamune because he's apparently murdering everybody uh, with his rifleman. Yeah, it is your fault. It, clearly, it's not because he's terrible. Yeah, retreat guy. I'm going to tell him to wait there, because I think... There is a guard on Yukimura's side of the map I left, or an officer I left alive, but I don't think he's that important. Oh, there we go. Can't afford to ignore him, you know. Okay, now I think maybe I've cleared out the officers. Or rather, the gate has opened up so that I can go after this guy. I got a bonus mission to take him out. That's a 
So that's the bonus mission done. That should unlock the path to Masamune. I might not get a chance to do the strategy where I caused the Date my rifle units to do friendly fire. So I just took out Masamune. Yeah, I think I did that too fast. I might have... The army of Kanto orders over a million, but I'm cooler than any of them. There's not a single man among them. I think, yeah, I think I actually broke the... Um, I think I might have broken some of the dialogue by doing that too fast. Who's left in the enemy army? Seems like we took everybody out. Oh, there's more guys up there that I need to get. Oh, I didn't actually mean to do that crap. Sazuke, get up there and deal with those two guys. Or at least go position yourself there so I can switch to you in a minute. So I defeated Masamune, but I left some other guy up here. Why can't you see that, Yukimura? I mean, Masamune has got a point. Okay, now that's the, so. That's also a side mission, I guess. Kanazuke Suzukita. He felt so bad about. Bakurobuchi, that's the samurai way, I guess, but don't worry, I'll avenge you. Don't care. So now we'll have Yukimura go after this guy that he'd left, uh, left alive so long ago. And Sazuke will finish these two guys off before they can kill whoever. Well, now what are we all in the panic about? I guess some guy died. Now we can execute stratagem. Increase the speed of our guys. Yukimura-san's inspiration declaration of attendance increased all of morale. The movement speed of the Allied officers has been restored. Okay. Masanori Fukushima? He wasn't here, was he? Masamori Fukushima. I guess it's Masamori, not Masanori. I don't know, anyway, this video is going to go a little long, but I feel like we're close to finishing this mission. I can't think of a good reason to, um... I've only got one officer left on the map. I'm sure plot will happen, but, um... In the meantime... Oh, we rescued the guy I was making talk with Kemper Palpatine in the dialogue. Uh-oh, there's fog. It's probably Hanzo's ninja magic that's actually doing it, to tell you the truth. And it has appeared and closed at the Moji gates. You jerks. At least the ninjas are marked on the map. That makes this a lot easier. Ninjas sure are easy to defeat, eh? Uh, oh, you're probably, you're probably not happy to hear me say that. Um... Master. 
Okay, so I think I need to save because it's probably intended that you do this with um, Sazuke. Now that the only officer who's left is Hattori Hanzo. The question in my mind is, are we going to achieve the feats? Uh, claim victory while the health of Katsunaga Mori and Terizumi Akashi are above fast half full. He's doing fine, and uh, yeah, I think we've got that one fairly easily, actually. We've got a couple of guys who are almost defeated, but not the guys who uh, count. Now, we got another feat. I'm sure at least four allied officers leave the battlefield. Unless something goes terribly wrong in the very near future, we should make that one. So, as okay, take care. I'm going to just duck out. I got this. Get away as quickly as you can. No, he's not going to. He's going to attack Anzo. Shall we begin with my Super Muso? Which apparently didn't hit you at all. I don't see how it completely missed him, but it did. Yeah, so we defeated Hanzo. We didn't get a lot of dialogue. And Sazuke did it. And he gets to hang out with his new boss. His older brother or whatever. I guess four officers didn't escape. I'm not sure. Anyway, let's see what the plot thinks should have happened. Well, there's not a lot of other troops around us. This is unusual. It's never taken you in. Now I have to murder you. It's a real pain in the butt. He doesn't look that nondescript as a ninja probably should. No. Sasuke. There's going to be a lot of pain when I have to murder you. <laughs> and now the students become the master. Only a master of not wearing a raccoon tail, Garth. Or it's a, is it a raccoon tail? It's like a fox tail. Pretty sure I know. Yeah, yeah, I was afraid of that. Oh. Are we gonna get a tear from Hanzo? Are they gonna go that far with this goofiness? Yes, they are. Pulling the heartstrings. Samurai warriors. Spirit of Sonata. Spirit of dead uh, robot ninja boy. I feel bad for giving Sasuke the goofy robot voice this whole time. Also, I feel bad that Yuki Mori didn't go kill Hanzo to keep uh, Sasuke safe, and I'm sure that would have no effect on this. So we got all the objectives. Uh, I don't know if we got the feats. We'll certainly get all of our Sonata points back. And we got the feats that actually... Yeah, we didn't have four allies leave the battlefield. Possibly because I defeated Hanzo too soon? Either way, we got the feats that actually unlock future stratagems. We got the stratagem points back, so I'm fine. Sazuke has leveled up to level 59 before his death. Spoils of War includes Sazuke's corpse item. Secrets of Courage level 2. Hanya Mask gives us determination. Whatever. So now we have the emotional fallout of uh, Sazuke's death to deal with. Kunoichi uh, is probably going to survive the story because she's not based on a real person, so it's easy for them to not kill her, but boy, she's not going to have a whole lot of friends left. <laughs> Yukimura Sanada's ferocious tenacity at the Battle of Domyoji prevented his allies from annihilation. Matabe Goto, however, was slain and... Lord Yukimura, it's Sasuke. He hasn't returned. He probably defected. What? 
The Osaka Summer Campaign had intensified the fever pitch. That might be the only cinematic, the closest thing we get to a cinematic about those characters reacting to his death, actually. Because there's a lot, a lot left to do that's battle-y. Osaka Summer Campaign had intensified the fever pitch. The only remaining hope of victory for the Toyotomi was to slay Iyasu Tokugawa. From his camp atop Mount Chaosu, Chaosu! Yukimura Sanada and his allies planned a bold raid directly into the heart of the enemy forces. Tien, is my telepathy working? I'm gonna take this guy with me! Chaosu! Ready to block their ingress were countless mighty warriors, including Masamune Date, Takatora Toto, and Kagakatsu Uesugi. So never mind, he's not done yet. Yukimura Sanada rallies Katsunaga Mori and Saku by Hota attacks Masamune Date. have been unlocked. We will check out these exciting stratagems next time, assuming I don't defeat the people you're supposed to target with those stratagems before they pop up as options, which has happened before. And uh, yeah, we'll be back with some probably Sazuke-free Samurai Warriors Spirit of Sanada. See you then.